well, hello to the YouTube universe, so to speak, um, and AWs, Nature Boy, the King of Wrestling, Steve Farrell, and this is a new sort of, a sort of idea that's been thrown around for a, a little YouTube blog to keep everyone updated with what's going on. Indeed, my thoughts and everything that's going on in the world of National Alliance Wrestling. Of course, you can check the website nawuk.com for further information where you can also find some fantastic DVDs for sale such as this, Britfest 2008. Excellent DVD. Speaking of Britfest though, just from the corner, NAW's big one. This is, this is anyone who's not familiar with NAW, this is our this is our big show. This is our WrestleMania, so to speak. Um, this is the 10th edition of Britfest this year, which dates back to 2002. I was honoured to be a part of the first ever um, Northern Britfest, which took place in Scarborough. Um, I wrestled a great wrestler called Eden, and unfortunately um, that footage is lost somewhere in the archives, but I'm sure it'll turn up one day. But anyway, enough of that. Um, I was asked recently by by someone on the internet my thoughts on who have who's impressed me most recently well you've got the obvious guys um fellow hall of famer from NAW Adam James Irwin has been red hot recently as always NAW champion Tyron's been brilliant his feud with Chris Taylor has been absolutely entertaining it's um it's kept me on my toes and it's been a pl privilege to call um, the action with those two guys um, and of course all the obvious guys um, your up and comers like Chris Goodwin and his tag team partner Alex McConnell it, it's all been good on collision but one person I think deserves a special mention um, and I never thought when I first met him that I would say this and that is um, Fusion number one contender to the Fusion title Ace Payne um, a guy who at one point was all for himself very selfish so to speak um, has suddenly developed into a very mature and respected wrestler. He's um, he's adapted his cruiser style to work with anyone, and he's a pleasure to watch. And he's really developing so well. And I, I can honestly say that one day he's going to be one of the maybe a top ten guy. Um, so he's been impressive recently, and that is. A great thing to see because when I first met Ace Payne, I didn't think he had a chance in hell. His attitude was wrong. He seemed to have an ego, and he just generally didn't come across well to not just me but many members of the community. Um, so, well done to him, um, Josh Wall. Of course, also in his new role as Fusion Champion, might be a bit of annoying. Might want to grab him by the neck, but that shows he's doing his job as the champion who everyone loves to hate. Um, so, until next time, for further updates, I'm Steve Farrell. Woo!